who was it up? Stacy Keebler. Stacy Keebler is the other rumor. That's a rumor. That's just, that's just a rumor. Um, that's um, not, not something that's um, definite etched in stone or anything like that. So, but I would love to see uh, someone like Stacy Keebler actually make that walk on the stage because she was another one who did so much uh, for this business. She was, she, I mean, she, Stacy, she was a, a head. To, she was someone you did not want to change the channel uh, when Stacy Keebler was on, man. And she didn't have to take one bump. That's what was that was the beauty about her career. Oh, I mean, Stacey Keebler, yes, obviously was a uh, was an attention getter for me uh, when I was watching uh, Monday Night Raw coming up. You know, we almost forget how good we had it as a young man coming into his into his teenage yeah. years. You know, I mean, at that one time on the roster, you got Lita, you got Trish, you got Tori Wilson, Stacey Keebler. I mean, the list went on and on and on. Sable, it was, it was Sable. Sable, Sable, respectfully. Yeah. Yeah. I'm saying all this respectfully. Yeah, but, yeah. You know, that's, that's Mrs. Lesnar, <laughs> bro. That was, I ain't talking about Mrs. Lesnar. I'm talking about Sable. I'm about Sable. Yeah, yeah that's, that's, that's a different person. Yeah. <laughs> I'm talking about Sable. No, I mean, yeah, all, all of them just great beauty. So it's a great time to be a young man coming up in the wrestling world. But really, for Stacy Keebler, I think, and maybe I'm way off on this, but I think because Stacy was like the first wrestler to really, in my opinion, cross over into like full Hollywood acceptance because she did dancing with the stars. I think she was the first wrestler on dancing with the stars that kind of made people start looking at this a little bit different. She started dating George Clooney. So you almost had like this a list wrestler woman. Right. Yeah, and I, yeah. and I think it, it may have turned the, turn the tide a little bit about the national conversation of wrestling. And I mean that sincerely. And I think that sometimes we think about the contributions of the business just inside the squared circle. But a lot of times you have to look at what these women have done uh, outside. And I think that Stacey Keebler doing the stuff that she's done, even going back to people like the Bella Twins and what they did with the reality show, bringing a whole new audience into WWE. That's why these women are still recognized for, for the accomplishments and the uh, what they've been able to give back to this industry because they brought more than your normal audience in. Yeah, I mean, um, you speak on that um, as for Stacy being a crossover. I mean, Stacy, you got to understand, she was Stacy. She was a super superstar, man. She really didn't know how big she was. I, 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 I really don't think so. Um, at one point in time, and then she started maturing, and then you start seeing the difference in Stacy Keebler, and you go, "Wow, man, um, she is definitely um on another level." And, and the thing is. Even though she was a wrestler, um, and I know um, at that point in time, you know, they had the divas, but Stacy was like a supermodel. She was someone that you could put in vogue. Um, yeah. I mean, she was definitely one of a kind. That's why, uh, for me, um, Stacy getting this nod, if she does get that nod and decide to walk on the stage, me personally, I ain't going to be mad at it. Not one time, not not one time, not one bit. Uh, just to see Stacy walk, uh, just one more time, and those <laughs> like, hey guys, st stick around. <laughs> You're in the Hall of Fame. <laughs> see you. You thinking about something else? I'm talking about. Oh yeah, I'm sure. Yeah, yeah. Stick around. You're in the Hall of Fame. We'll be back in a minute.